Hello everybody, welcome to my series where I talk about the guns in CSGO, a little bit of history about the guns and the in-game use for them. Today we are covering the USP Silence Tactical Handgun. The USP Silence Tactical Handgun is the handgun used for CT Starter Pistol on the CT side. It is either that or the P2000. It was created by h &K, and if you want more information about that, you can see my other video about the P2000. The USP itself was invented in 1993 and spawned off multiple variants, including this one, the USP Tactical. There are three different types, the 40 Smith & Wesson, 45 Auto, and 9mm. Though this one has 12 bullets, that leads me to believe that we use the 45 Auto. In game with the silencer on, the spread is actually pretty small. However, when you take the silencer off, it does a curious thing, actually making it more difficult to control the spread of the gun. This means you should probably never take off the silencer since it is more reliable with the silencer on. While moving, the accuracy is actually pretty steady, especially if you tap shoot with it. Even with the silencer off, the accuracy is still pretty good while moving. In fact, the accuracy isn't that terrible with the silencer off, but if you spray the entire clip, it's going to be pretty bad. The gun itself also is more difficult to use in the rounds later on because it has such a low armor penetration, much like the Glock. It also has the lowest amount of bullets out of all starting pistols with 12 bullets, as opposed to the P2000 with 13 or the Glock that has 20. It does, however, have an edge with the silencer on, making it one of only two guns in the entire game with a silencer. This gives you a slight edge over everybody else during round one, since nobody will actually know where you are unless they see you. This makes the gun actually not too terrible if you use it tactically, hence the name USP Tactical. So as a starting CT, you can either go for punch and bullets, or you can go for silence. The choice is yours. Anyways, thank you very much for watching this video. If you want more information about the gun, go ahead and see the links in the description. Thank you very much for watching, and I hope you all have a fantastic day.